What's, What's up, up YouTube? YouTube? Today we are trying childhood snacks. Welcome back to the <laughs> snack game, baby. So our next food challenge is literally trying snacks we were having as 90s kids. Yeah, what 90s kids, pretty 90s much kids. like, you know what your mom used to put in your lunchbox. Yeah, we exactly. We um, are starting strong with the mini chips a high. Oh God. Never got those when never I was a kid. Never got those, yeah. but- I'm gonna tell you right now, I never got anything, man. My mom used to give me slices of apples and- You had an organic cheese mom. cheese sticks and carrots, dip, and whatever things in thermoses and stuff okay. like I never yeah. had any cool snacks he like had a this. he had a crunchy mom I had the parents who didn't give a fuck <laughs> okay, cheers. I got cheers it's not to say that I've never had. I've had these before. Yeah, they're alright. They're good. I mean, yeah. Whatever. It's typical, like... But to me, if I were to rate it on nostalgia, I'd give it like a four. Mm, so I would say five. Five? Not the most nostalgic snack no. of my childhood, for sure. Alright, next. I don't know what this one's called, so I'm gonna let you go for it. This one is a O Caramel. O Caramel. Never had that in my life, actually. Oh, it's like from the Vachon brand, which is a Quebec brand. Really, really popular. Um, you have Jolie, you have May West, you have a couple of those. But this one, I remember having this one as dessert so many times in my childhood. Really? Yeah. Man, you ate a bunch of shit, huh? Yeah. I, literally, I had parents who didn't care about how much sugar they would give their kids, so. Mmm. Just as good as I remember. Mmm, 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 mmm. Pretty good, huh? Don't like it? Oh my god, these were my childhood desserts. Like, after dinner, we had one of those. Yeah. Makes me sick. So, rating on nostalgia, I'd say a good 7 out of 10 for me. Okay, I'm in. I'd say like a 0 out of 10, because I've never had that in my life. Really? Before we move on, guys, yes. like, subscribe, share the video, comment below. We want to do more food challenges. If you got good ideas, let us know. All right, let's move on. Fruit by the foot. 10 foot on long. 10. This, this is, is like, the best. My parents would give this and split it in two with me and my sister before we went to bed. I swear. Yo, you want to know something weird? You know those, you know those kids that would like take it and wrap it around those, their finger? Dude, for sure, they had issues because they would wrap it around the finger and walk around. Yes, I remember. Oh. I know I would always ask my parents for this edge. Yeah, because that's the best this edge. That's the best, dude. so I'll give <laughs> Yeah, you can take the edge. This I'm gonna eat all of it, dude. Okay. <gasps> I was just get a shot. But I used to get the rainbow one. It's not the, the flavor I used to get. Yo, this, this, and it's like all like, oh, mm. it was nasty, dude. Mm. This is, 10 out of 10 yeah. nostalgia. Like, I love this. It's the best. Every night before going to bed. Thank you, mom and dad, for making my childhood so cool. So weird. Okay. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, this is. I've never had this when I was a kid, but I had it like a little later on. But I would never have them like at home. Dunkaroos. And we have. This is classic. The vanilla and the chocolate. This, this is, is a classic. Classic 9 out of 10. 90s, though. 90s. 9 stuff. out of 10 nostalgia for same, me. Same. I had these in my lunchbox. Very nostalgic when these kids would whip it out their lunchbox. And I'm like, oh, you guys got Dunkaroos. So apparently they've changed their recipe or something since the 90s, so they, they don't taste the same. What do you mean? The, those weren't the cookies. The cookies were little really? the kangaroo were shaped. Oh yeah. I but these are better to dip. Mm. It's just very nostalgic. Not very good though. This is this is definitely a child snack. I'd get the chocolate one more often. But again, the chocolate one was was, was with regular cookies. Yeah, the chocolate one is more nostalgic for me. Really? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so it's very, 9 out of 10 nostalgic, but on taste, it's Yeah, it's definitely do. super nostalgic to me, too. I've seen so many kids pull that out. All right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This one, this, oh this I've had, though. God. This I had at home. Pop-Tarts, but the strawberry one, like the OG. I would eat that for breakfast. Put it in a toaster and, like, eat you that You would toaster food. them? Yeah. Nah. I would I'd just eat one, one and my sister would eat the other one. Toasters are for toasty strudels. Oh, no, my just, God. just, like, eat one. These used to be so good, dude, back in the day. Like, everybody would love these. Oh, nice. We're not the same anymore, you know what I mean? What do you mean? Oh, back then I feel like when you were eating these, it was like, yo, it was like life-changing, but... Okay, these? I don't know if you guys know these. The oh. Chewy Quaker. Classic. All classic lunchbox Straight snacks up. for me. Like, literally all the time, every single day. I never had what everybody would have. Yo, I was like the kid that, like, you know, like, the kids would be looking at me and they, like, I open my lunchbox and they would just, like, Pity me because I had absolutely nothing good in there, you know what I mean? Slices of apples and stuff, you know, they all had chewy bars. So they're just like, oh, here, Nico, have a little piece of my chewy bar, you know? Or go to daycare and they would have these as a snack. With like a little milk carton, with a little milk carton. And I was like, yo, let's go. I would steal some sometimes and I would get like two or three yo, of them. This is an eight out of 10 nostalgic for me. Yeah, it's just so good. So good. So good. Mm. I can't believe our parents would feed us so much sugar. 
I'm telling you, I'm never feeding my children this. Like, we're never. Just only, only for the tube. Though. Awesome. Mm. Only for the tube, yeah. Okay. Never. Oh my god. A Jolie. Vachon. Mm. I, I don't think they have that in the States. It's very Canadian, Quebecois. They have something else. So, awesome. my story of that is that I was first grade in school. So, we're what, six years old? And every birthday, our educatrice would give us one with a candle on it. And we had two choices. For your Either, yeah, for our birthday, that's cool. That's Either cool. we would we would, sh we would cut it and share with everyone. So cut this thing in 15 pieces, or you keep it for, to yourself. What do you think I choose? This I would get my lunchbox. I, don't, I think my my parents drew the line there. Like this is too much. This is like a full out cake, man. Mm -hmm. it's too much. Mm. It's very good though. I like Joe Louis. Mm. Uh, if I would choose a uh, Joe Louis or a Mae West, um, not true. Joe Louis or Mae West, probably Mae West. Talking about with Mae West. This is the next one, Mae West. So, okay, let me open it, man. Same principle, but vanilla cake, I think, right? Yeah. Mmm. That's the one I like. I like that. Oh yeah, you like that, huh? Mm hmm. This is a good one. Mmm. It tastes so similar to me. It it it's. I would say it's nostalgic because you would always have that like one kid who would get these, mm -hmm. and everybody's tripping and you'd be out. Jealous. It's crazy because now you eat that and you're like, ugh, it's too much. But back then, man, you would scrumple it down. Next. Ritz crackers. I never liked these. Cheese these sandwiches. Ah, uh, yeah. But I remember I'd get the little bag. Absolutely disgusting. You know, like the big box with the small mini ones? Yeah, oh, that's it's too what much. I get. Oh. These ones are the bigger ones. It's like, ones. A, what kind of cheese is that? It's like some spray can cheese. And it's yeah, that's too much. disgusting. Man. Mm. It's all right. Nostalgic. It that's is definitely good. nostalgic because Ritz is like a, you know? Definitely an 8 out of 10 nostalgia. Oh, it's, it's one so of those, salty. I know, it's, it's actually not that bad. But it's definitely one of those, like, you know, like those poster brands. Like, everybody knows what a Ritz cracker is, right? Okay, so a Twinkie. I remember kids getting these in their lunchbox. Really? Box, but for me, it's not, I mean, I'd say 2 out of 10 nostalgic. My parents never really me, watched Me, zero nostalgic. I was so sure that this was, like, just an it's American thing. No. So, I don't even remember what it tastes like. I thought it was just an American thing. Ooh, yeah, this is like much. weird, man. You know when they make movies, like American make movies, and they're like, oh, I need to get myself a Twinkie, like Ghostbusters. Like that was a, it was a classic mm. uh, Oh my God, this is way too sweet. It hits you after you swallow it. Really? Why would you feed your kids this? This was good back then. Oh, I'm already so full. So another Vartan, another little bar that we would frequently get called the Quaker Dips. So they're dipped in chocolate. And this one was the one I would always get. This is another Carmel 10 on 10. Caramel and nuts. This is another 10 on 10 Oh nostalgic. my gosh, so nostalgic. This is what it looks like, guys. The kids would either get those ones or the other Chewy bar. It's mm -hmm. really good though. This is really good. This is a good bar. I mean, right now I'm only freaking full, but... I actually do a bar. I taste it now. No. Good. I like this one. The, the bars are the best. Yeah, they're really the bars because it's a typical like lunchbox snack that everyone would get. I agree. Oh, guys, the Weep It! I think it's another, yeah, it's another, is it Vachon? No, it's not Vachon, it's there. I don't there. think so. But it's very typical here in Quebec. Like, and I want to I wanna show, nostalgic. I want to show Nico how we used to eat the Weep It. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's funny. That's yeah. how you eat a Weep It. Yeah, and then you break it. Weird. I don't even wanna, uh, it's very nostalgic though. I used mm -hmm. to have these in my head and I used to eat a lot of these desserts, too. Desserts, desserts for, for me after dinner. But, but it feels not that good. You know, no. it's it's the it's the marshmallow in it that's just, Yeah, ugh. marshmallow's not good. Mm. Mm. It's just not good anymore. Oof. We are at our last item, which is another very nostalgic for me, which is in the same um, category of the fruit roll-ups, but it's called, yes, yeah, the roulé fruit roll-ups instead of the foot long. So it's like a, a sheet of paper. You remember these? Yeah, of course. I remember, I remember because... where they were in my pantry at home. Like at the really? top and I would climb and get one. Yeah. No, I remember like you would do like faces them in them and put them on your yes, face. Yes. and like Tattoos. Tattoo. Oh, they're... I remember those. There used to be tattoos so on this them. This is what it looks like. Dude, oh my God, so this was fun. so good. Yeah, this this so too, I'm gonna eat it all. This is so good. Yeah, I, I'll Super. have a bite. And... I love the, ru the fruit roll-ups. Mm. Fruit roll-ups are tasty, man. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. It's so good. Mm. You know, on TikTok they're doing it like wrap ice cream and like put it in the freezer. Apparently it's so good. No way. Mm -hmm. That sounds pretty good actually. It gets all crunchy. Oh yeah, it gets all frozen crunchy. It's like ice cold. Mm -hmm. That's a good idea. Mm. I'm so full. That was good, I guess. Yeah, that was a throwback. Really good throwback. Yeah, nostalgia at its finest actually. Mm -hmm. You know what's funny? It's more of the visual that For me, is yeah. nostalgic because the taste is nah. like... It's not something that you know you. Yeah, it's more of yeah. it's more of a. Yeah. A, 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 Comment a, 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 down below what's your 
nostalgic snack like your most nostalgic snack what was yours for out of all the ones we had what was your most nostalgic probably fruit roll up fruit roll up same the, yeah. both of them like i ate so many of them it's a staple it's a staple brand man yeah everybody loves fruit roll up so please guys like and subscribe comment down below what other food challenge you want us you want us to do because we are ready and please don't feed your kids all that sugar like our parents did like that's just just wrong Let's Peace out.